Hello students. The Johnson Art Teachers would like to take a moment to talk with you about all of your possible artistic options over the course of your high school career. In your journey through art, you will want to start with Art 1. Art 1 is a prerequisite for all other studio art classes and is designed like a sampler platter of art methods and media so that you can get a taste of all that we offer here at Johnson. During your time in Art 1, you will be introduced to drawing, painting, sculpture, and photography. The goal in that first year is for you to get a better idea of what interests you most as you move forward. After Art 1, you should move into a Level 2 class. We offer drawing, painting, sculpture, and photography classes at this level. If you were to start in Art 1 as a freshman, your goal should be to continue in one of those areas over the next three years. Should you decide to take a Level 2 class, then want to switch to a different area the following year, you should plan to again start at the 2 level. For instance, if you take Drawing as a sophomore, then want to try Painting as a junior, you should elect Painting 2 for your junior year. The Level 2 classes are intended to give you a solid foundation in that media, whereas Level 3 classes are designed to expand upon the knowledge you should have acquired at the second level. Therefore, if you jump from Drawing 2 to Painting 3, you will not be adequately prepared to be successful at the Painting 3 level since you would have missed the Painting 2 foundation. We do also offer AP Drawing, AP Studio 2D, and AP Studio 3D courses. These are taught as college level courses and are intended to take the place of a level 4 class. We highly suggest that students take at least one level 2 class before entering into AP Studio classes. After all, you wouldn't take Algebra 1 then skip to Calculus, would you? AP classes are taught with the understanding that students have already completed foundation work in at least one of our art subjects. We do not focus on media and procedures at the AP level, but instead challenge students to use their previously acquired skills to develop their own artistic styles and voices. For AP Drawing, students should take either Drawing or Painting. For AP Studio 2D, students should take Drawing, Painting, or Photography. And for AP Studio 3D, students should first take Sculpture. If possible, taking both a Level 2 and Level 3 class before enrolling in an AP Studio class will give you an even better foundation. With any AP Studio class, students are expected to submit an AP portfolio at the end of the year. Beyond studio classes, our department also offers AP Art History and Dual Credit Art Appreciation. Both of these programs are run independently from the studio classes and can be taken by sophomores, juniors, or seniors without any prerequisites. AP Art History is taught more like a history class where students will explore different time periods and cultures through art. Dual Credit Art Appreciation is like a combination of art history and studio art classes, with instructional time being split between studying art and artists and actually making art. I hope that this presentation has given you a better understanding of your options in art. From all of the art teachers here, we look forward to making Johnson a more artistic place with you.